Yes, well, now that spring is just around the corner, this is the perfect sport to participate in. I'm here with Donato. He's one of the organizers of Northern Kentucky Street Soccer. So you're showing me some skills. I've never played this before. It's really fun, and it's a little bit different than traditional soccer. How is that? Uh, that is correct. So it is different. You use your soul more. The space is smaller, and that really uh, translates to actual soccer when you need to use, you know, when you're in tight spaces. Uh, yeah. And of course, we're on a basketball court. That's correct. obviously different. Right. That's way different, you know. So the game is traditionally played like basketball size, so yeah. it's perfect. You know, you don't really need them, and you don't have to change the game anymore. Just yeah. two goals and one ball. Yes, and you're yep. from Honduras. You I said am. this was really important to you guys over there, very popular sport. There's a lot of international, some immigrant kids here in northern Kentucky. Why do you think this is important for them to have a piece of their culture here? So it's important, you know, with soccer being very, uh, very the popular sport around the world, having futsal, you know, as a, another means to play the sport, creates the space to bring those kids together and just play in the sport, have fun, you know, meeting new kids meeting new friends yes and it is easily accessible and free which is great for these families because sports can be really expensive that is correct so yeah so with the rising cost of sports here in america having a free accessible um area for these kids to play actually you know brings that eventually will bring the cost down you know for families yes definitely i love how it's bringing communities together you want to score a goal for us yep sure all right let's see it Great. Thank you, Donato. Oh, Remember, welcome. this is happening on Saturdays. That's from 9 to 11. Right now, it is at Grace Church. For now, back to you guys. All right, Chloe, thank you. Right now, there are only two locations for street soccer. Organizers are working on finding new areas to play. You can always get local stories right here on YouTube, but go ahead and hit that subscribe button to get notifications to stay in the know.